Let's look for down here. Oh, bringing you the 100% walkthrough of Heretic on the Black Plague possesses the difficulty with Elven Wand Start for every map. And in the last video, we took care of E1M6, the Cathedral, the sixth map of Episode 1, City of the Damned. And within that map, we found our first secret exit of the game, which takes us to E1M9, the Graveyard. And that is the secret map of Episode 1. Alright, it's a really rough map. We're going to go to the stairs first, avoid all of these axes. And we're going to go straight to this door. And we're going to kill this Nitro Golem. And press the switch. I mean, open the wall. There's your first of two secrets. Alright, we'll grab the yellow key. Press the switch. And there's going to be a Tome of Power. And then it's, it's a trap. Wall lowers, there's disciples, but uh, just leave right away. I got hit, but that's okay. I'm gonna go to this area next. Start, start circle strafing. Grab the dragon claw. And, uh, and then proceed to dealing with these, uh, these nitro orbs. Although the, yeah, because the, don't worry about the gargoyles, just focus on the golems. And just keep circle strafing around the structure. Eventually they're all going to die. I think I got hit by a gargoyle. Go. We took out another go go Nitro Golem. There we go. Another Golem down. And another Nitro Golem down. focusing and making sure I kept circle strafing and not getting hit. So yeah, we just have to use the dragon claw. No uh, crossbow yet. But when there's less, you can start making your way onto this, onto these platforms that raise and lower. And that's how you handle it. grab some warps and we'll go ahead and go back to the wand and we want to press the switch while we're at it. Okay, it's just one nitro golem so we'll go ahead and use the wand. With that, we can go inside and we got ourselves the green key. So that's what we come inside here for and that's it. Nothing else here to get. So, we'll just grab some more orbs, we can open up this door, and then now we got these uh, undead warriors and coming at us, they're all, they're all gathered over here, so now it's better to deal with them like this. Could even use the Tome of Power, but uh, I'd rather not because it's going to use up, keep in mind that it uses up a lot of ammo, so uh, we're not going to do that. Just a normal dragon claw without any powers up. Any power up is fine. And then we got this one undead warrior. We'll just use the the wand to finish him up. And there's an extra one over here. And you gotta watch out because, like I said, I, oh, I haven't mentioned this since they're ethereal. Yeah, like I said, they only throw red axes. So this beginning is dangerous because of it. But that takes care of them. Oh, look at more. 
claw orbs. Let's grab some claw orbs. This earlier, but now we got the silver shield, so now that's gonna help a lot. Now we grab the gauntlets, morph of them, and uh, here, another quartz flask. And uh, yeah, sometimes they'll infight, yeah, the ethereal undead warriors amongst each other, but they won't, yeah, they're not gonna win because of that. But this is actually a good spot to use a morpho, so I think I'll use it right here. And of course, these uh, the chickens will attack you still, so you gotta take them out. And if you're not quick enough, you know what happens. Uh, undead warriors will go back to their original form. So now that we have the green key, we'll enter this next section over here. And you know what? Just go ahead and just use the claw orb. Better yet, we're just going right here to get a crossbow out of my face. I won't hesitate to use a crossbow on a gargoyle when it's in my face. a lot of them so don't be shy with using dragon the dragon claw on these gargoyles and the numbers are thinned down then we can well there's still some but now we can go back to the bond and then all that remains are these two fire gargoyles Take this phone call i'll be right back okay guys so i'm back turns out it's just spams or scam regardless of the nature yeah not worth picking up it's just a waste of time but i'm back guys so we cleared everything out so uh there's a switch over here in the back and it is right over here so Go ahead and pick up our provision, no, like our items, more supplies for the, our weapons. Okay, takes care of that. And by the way, there are uh, nitro golems behind some fake walls, but we don't need to take them care of them. We can go over here instead. Be careful because there's traps. Take some damage, I'll go ahead and use a quartz flask. Okay, takes care of all the undead warriors. We can get the items from here. There's still more hidden walls. Not hidden walls, but yeah, they're tra trap areas. So we gotta go and use another quartz flask after taking some damage. Still another undead warrior. There's a few more. These walls are gonna raise. Oh, and there's also a uh, some nitro bolts. So we'll go ahead and use the. We'll go back to the dragon claw. Still getting hit by these undead warriors. Got to use even more quartz flask. I had to use all of them. But now we're over here to the secret area, and uh, takes care of this area. So we need to heal up, and we already have the secrets. All that remains are some items at the end. So, 
now we go back to this area that we rushed to at the beginning okay there was the disciples there's some golems got to find the other disciple or perhaps it was infighting that took care of everything just rushing through have a lot of ammo so no Stick to the crossbow on all of them. I hear another disciple. Looks like he's still alive. Must be in here. Yep. Alright. They're taking care of... Oh yeah, we didn't get the supports flask. But now we have an extra. Yep. Some tie bombs, which you can check, but don't go up the stairs yet. I recommend going around the perimeter first to take out the gargoyles. Look at some more ethereal golems over here. They're all coming from inside this area. Okay, now we want to be careful in this area. There's, yeah, there's supposed to be a switch. Oh, but first let's grab some our items, the time bombs. All right, we have one more item left. But first, it's the switch that we need to press. And there's golems in here. A lot of them. And you know, yeah, let's go ahead and use the, the Tome of Power. Let's keep checking. Let's check our kill. We have one more, one more monster right over here. He's dead, but we have one. Oh yes, the map scroll, which is really pointless because it comes at the end of the map. It's useless, but that was all the items, the secrets and kills. So you just gotta go back into the trap area to, to lower this pillar in the middle, take the teleporter, and there you have it. That's the graveyard. That didn't take too much time, but we're done already. Anyway, what can I say about this? Well, it's hectic at the beginning. We've got a lot of undead warriors with red axes, so don't even bother fighting them at the beginning. Get yourself well armed. And go for a. Well, first, get the yellow key, and then enter the area, get your dra dragon claw as soon as possible, kill everyone, get the green key, and then you can proceed to killing the undead warriors. And you'll be fine. But it gets really tough. You just don't want to be there getting hit from projectiles from all angles. So get your dragon claw first and then you can take them from behind the door. From the other side of the doorway. And then after that, you can go and get your crossbow. After opening the green key, you'll be fine from there. But yeah. As long as you, you handle the, all the undead warriors, undead warriors at the beginning, the rest of the map isn't so bad. So honestly, yeah, it can be really bad, but I'll tell you what, I still think uh, the Citadel is a tougher map than the Graveyard, than what we've done with so far. Even though this is tough at the beginning, it's still... Uh, this doesn't... it's got nothing on the Citadel. That's what I have to say, but I actually I like this secret map. It's a great, it's a great map. Now with that said, in the next video, we're gonna move on to E17, which is the crypts. This is Slipper Fodong here, and I'll catch you guys then.